Welcome to my channel, Living Linux. I finally managed to install Debian on the Mikrotronics R58X with the Rockchip RK3588. When you have the correct file, it's similar to installing a different Android image. And I already did that in one of my previous videos. So here we can see that we're on Debian 11 bullseye. Uh, this is a rather old GNOME version and we're on X11. Um, well, I have to say that this is still work in progress, so they're still hard at work to improve things. And one of the things I noticed was that um, the sources for the updates and installing new software. So originally it's pointing to a I guess it's a Chinese FTP site of Debian. Uh, so I changed it into this, just the general Debian. And then, uh, well, at least for me at the moment, I have way more options to install. So uh, I'm using a screen recorder at the moment. So I was able to install simple screen recorder and I wasn't able to find it on the Chinese FTP. And I was also able to install Chromium uh, because out of the box you get uh, Firefox ESR, which is uh, not the best. Um, I also saw the news that uh, they are going to release the R58 without the X and it will be a simpler version of the R58X. So you will lose one of the ethernet ports. So you only get one. And I think they also um, leave out one of these SATA ports. So you only get one, uh, but you do get the IR receiver. I'm not really sure if it's on mine because so far I haven't seen it. But I mean, like if you don't need all the bells and whistles, then this could be a nice option. And hopefully they will be able to uh, ship them very quickly. Because um, yeah, I'm also still waiting for the Racha Rock 5, but yeah, I haven't seen any news that they're coming anytime soon. Um, but the good thing is, is that more options are coming. So if you don't want to wait for the Rock 5, then here you can see the prices for the R58 and you get a small discount when you pre-order. And just a quick test, the WebGL Aquarium. And well, this looks okay. It's not uh, perfect. It does have some glitches here and there, but like I said, they're still working on um, optimizing Debian. So as this is just um, work in progress, then I'll just wait until we get an update. And hopefully there I can show you some more stuff. That's all for now. And I hope to see you again in my next video.